Hello, hello, hello. Here we are. That was probably a little bit louder than uh, I am right now. So, well, we may have an audio kink to work out a little bit. But here we go, guys. The next LP this channel is going to see uh, for right now. I don't know how often... I, I gotta figure out a lot of stuff as we go through it, but I have been waiting to play this game for a long time. I could not be more freaking excited about it. Um, this will be a blind play, so if you are looking for somebody to find all of the secrets and know about them, then unfortunately this will not be the play for you. However, for those who have been around my channel for a while already know that as an RPG player, I already play things as much to 100% as possible, whether I know the game already or not, and uh, I generally do pretty good with it. Um, the first time I played the first Bioshock blind, on hard mode, I got all the achievements the first run, I didn't miss a single thing, so it's certainly within my realm of possibility, and it's certainly something I'm going to shoot for, just to give you guys a little, uh, a little perspective on exactly, hopefully, how this is going to go. Um, I've already, I don't know, because I say it's going to be blind, I know essentially nothing about the game. I've loaded this up just enough to go through the settings and customize my controls and things like that, and that's just about all I know um, so everything will be a nice learning process with me uh, with that please everybody refrain from any kind of even minor spoiler in the comments uh, should other people be watching this LP who have seen or have played the game and you happen to see something that is any sort of spoiler <coughs> excuse me please uh, thumbs down and flag it and mark it as spam and all that crap so when I see such comments marked as spam with 14 thumbs down. I will know not to read them. Thank you. Uh, your appreciation is already much obliged. And uh, therefore, without really any further ado, I seriously cannot wait to play this game any longer. I pre-ordered the Collector's Edition on Xbox, and uh, it's just been hanging out, sitting on my desk for a long time, and uh, a buddy helped me get the PC version for this reason so I could play it on PC, because I feel like every time I want to play a game, I may as well just play it on PC and record it for my channel. So, let's go, guys. Let's get this going. Let's start a brand new game. Overwrite your recent autosave. Yeah, because I loaded it up to see if it worked. I didn't even move around. Let's get rid of that. We're going to play on hard mode? Of course we're going to play on hard mode. I hope you guys expected me to play on hard mode. Is there a super hard? Oh, there's just an easy and a hard and a medium. Well, sorry about that guys. If there's a super hard, I probably would play it on super hard. I will do my best not to talk during uh, scenes or other dialogue and things like that because I obviously want to experience the game myself. So excited, so excited. You've unlocked the golden pistol and machine gun upgrades. Are you afraid of God? I'm afraid of you. The mind of the subject will desperately struggle to create memories where none exist. Okay, not sure I... Eh, not sure how I feel about that, but... 1912. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Rowing. Rowing? I planned on it. So you expect me to show What's the this? burden? No. I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. <laughs> then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing that one could fail. But one does not undertake an experiment <clears> if <throat> one has Alright, we got some failed. symbols up there. Bring One, two, the two. Rowing. I suggest you do. We got a gun. Something about New there. York. No. I mean, I picture of Elizabeth. Uh, Monument Island. I'm just trying to get a quick grasp of what all this stuff is in my case. I'm assuming that's me, because, you know, first person. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. Ha, play on words. Love it. <laughs> Sorry for skip or for talking over a little bit of the dialogue there. Uh, part of an LP is going through what you're thinking at the time, and... You know, if something is going on, to uh, make sure you're letting He's people know what's moving. going on. He will, eventually. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> Those people are pretty funny. Alright, so here we are. Wow, that's sensitive. 
I, uh, I'm not used to PC gamer or PC gamers, PC FPSs. I've uh, I've dabbled very little since Counter Strike 1.6. I've been mostly a console gamer since, but uh, I'm not too concerned. Oh wait a second, I have a sensitivity control on my mouse. Oh, that's so much nicer. That's a little low actually. So I'm already exploring right off the bat, finding some money. Um, trying to get used to my controls here. Which right now it seems I don't really have any controls, so that's fine. I do have a run button. I, I remember that. And, uh, I guess we're stranded on this thing. It's very reminiscent of the first Bioshock where your plane crashes in front of a lighthouse. And they didn't have anything else laying around in that first Bioshock. So I'm assuming they're not really going to have anything around here. I take that back. I got some money and a can of beans. <laughs> Great. Thanks for that can of beans. Bring us the girl and wipe away the debt. This is your last chance. Excuse me. It's Booker DeWitt. I guess you're expecting me? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, that's what we look like. <laughs> Apparently, we're not very religious in this game. Just taking a quick look around. I'll do that a lot, guys. This is one thing I, I am slightly concerned about with me doing this LP. Uh, normally, shooters are obviously much faster paced than an RPG, but I have an RPG mindset and a is defensive mindset Hello? towards just about everything that I do. Uh, I like to explore. I like to backtrack. I like to take my time. Um, so while I'm going to certainly try and not waste time and be efficient, and I'm usually really good at that, some parts, for those of you who have played the game before, may go a little slow, because you're going to be aware of what's going on, and I'm not, so you must stop him, see you. Alright, well. Sweet, more money. I didn't even check my surroundings. I went upstairs and I didn't even look around. I could have been attacked. Cereal. Dude, how are you still hungry? You had a can of beans. You had some cereal. You had a pickle. What else do you want? Use a sink. That's great. Alright, so there's that. Seems like everything just... Oh, another sign. To thy own land. Whatever. A bloody hand. That's good. That's, that's a great sign. Okay, so there's nothing up there for me. Is that George Washington? Nice. Or Could be somebody else, but I'm just going to avoid... F oh, boy. <laughs> I'm going to refrain from names just in case I'm wrong. Uh, I'm assuming this game is rated M for Mature. I didn't even check, but I'm 99% sure it is. So, you know, parents, if you're watching your kid right now, I'm sorry, I, I didn't mention that earlier. Just in case. <clears throat> that said, while the game will have its blood and gore, uh, I do my best to not swear very much, and it should be pretty limited myself. Whew. Well, now we've climbed to the top of this lighthouse, and there's not a thing around. I guess there's a, a city way down there, a couple of cities. That's really about it. More stuff, more loot. And that seems to be just about everything we've got up here, so... Use these bells. Hey, these are the symbols that I saw in that box. See? I knew it was good I paid attention to that box. Wait a minute, that card. Oh, you still have it. Never mind. Did I do it right? Oh, that... Why? Wow, the whole sky went red. I guess I did it right. I do know that this game takes place in an airborne city, so that's why I'm looking at the sky a little bit. Let's look directly into the lighthouse from point blank. I'm sure that doesn't hurt. <laughs> 
those people are still on the boat that take carried me here, what the hell would they be thinking right now? Like, holy crap, what is going on? Because that would be tremendously scary. This looks good. Let's just climb into this little Saiyan pod over here. <laughs> I, don't, I really don't want to, but obviously I, uh, I know I have to. It's a ni that's a nice barber's chair. Nice old-fashioned. Although I noticed in my peripheral the uh, the arm clamp. There they go. <laughs> I wondered if that was going to happen. Make yourself ready, Pilgrim. The bind beams are there as a safeguard. If this wasn't so... Oh, my gun! No! My red nine! I have no control right now. Oh, I can look around a little bit. <laughs> oh, God. I don't really like heights very much. This is a little creepy. Jeez. What? Wow, look at that. That's their Statue of Liberty, I guess. Dang. This is so reminiscent of the first one, too. Instead of a whale, there's a blimp. <laughs> Hopefully this thing lands properly. I have no idea how long I want to make these episodes, but uh, I assume somewhere between 30 and an hour. Father Comstock, our prophet. <laughs> What's up, Santa Claus? <laughs> why would she, why would he send his savior on to us? He will not raise a finger for our own salvation. And though we deserve not his mercy, he has led us to this new Eden. Way to sound like Assassin's Creed. A last chance for redemption. I don't know what any of that means! It probably makes more sense once you beat in the game. Prophet shall lead the people to the new Eden. Okay. Can I move yet? Sort of. Oh no, I'm sorry. I'm still chained in. <laughs> well, let's get the heck out of here. I'm sorry, if I was just chained in a chair and rocketed 15,000 feet up, uh, I wouldn't slowly get out of my chair. I would get out of my chair very quickly. Find, push M to navigate. Oh, sweet! It gives us a Dead Space quest arrow. I love it. All right, I'm going to look around a little bit. Uh, if the arrow wants me to go that way, I'm not going to go that way. That is the style in which I play video games, ladies and gentlemen. Although I don't seem to have many other options. I don't have any other options. I'm going that way. You got me, game. Looks like Zeus? No, it looks like, well, sort of. More like Poseidon, I suppose. They're all kind of similar, aren't they? They're brothers, after all. Okay, it wants me to go around, so I will not. And in my womb shall grow the seed of the prophet. So I guess she's the prophet's mommy, huh? Sweet! Oh, I thought that was money! Dang it, just a gum wrapper. There you go. Taking all these people's money. What if they don't use the same currency up here? I mean, really now. Really. I don't care, I'm gonna take it all. Give it to me, come on. Thank you. I can't quite read that, but that's okay. Anything else on the- ooh, a bag. More money. God, these people are really careless. Finders, keepers, losers, weepers. A voxophone, huh? 
love the prophet because he loves the sinner. I love the sinner because he is you. Without the sinner, what need is there for a redeemer? Without sin, what grace has forgiveness? Excuse me, where am I? Oh, I love how the... Or as close as we'll see till judgment day. You Just keep such questions to myself. You look a little fruity. It's kind of weird. Awkward outfit. I love how the uh, player character saw him before I did. The, the lamb. The future of our city. See how much more people have left. Oh, uh, a wallet with nothing in it. I guess you tithed all your loot, huh? Did that say a hat box? That's a heck of a hat box. Jeez. Okay. Well, whatever. Some people wear big hats. Especially at church. I guess that is a thing. Wait, I'm taking all the church's money. This isn't just money laying around. I'm taking a church's money. Uh, whatever. Okay, I think we've finally gone around this... Yeah, we've gone around this whole circle now. Can't even read that. Clavum? I don't even know what that means. Gladium. Gladius, perhaps? Clavum, is that a key? I don't know. I don't speak whatever that is. Volman. And every year... On this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Comstock. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet waters of baptism. And lo, if the prophet has struck down our enemies at wounded knee and not railed against the sodom beneath us, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just railed against the sodom beneath us, us, but not except the three golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the three golden gifts of the founders and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden and not purged the vipers of the Orient, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just purged wow. the vipers How far of the is this gonna go? but not suffered the sacrifice of his beloved, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just suffered the sacrifice of his beloved, but not expelled the vox populi, it would have been enough. Wow, that went on a lot longer than I expected it to. Okay, so new terms. We just had a uh, Sodom Orient vox populi. Uh, that's all my brain caught. There might have been something else. Oh, New Eden, but that was this place, I assume. Uh, where do I... I guess I just pushed through these guys? Oh. Is it Ooh, AD on my hand. Did you see that, guys? From the below. I have a Newly tattoo. After death. I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Huh. I guess if that's the only option I'm gonna give be given. And be cleansed. Hallelujah. <laughs> this guy looks evil. In the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. Oh. I don't know, brothers and sisters, but this one doesn't look clean to me. <laughs> Great. Whoa, 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 whoa. You re really? You just drowned. You just drowned. You couldn't beat up an old man? Ah. <sighs> What do you want? We got a deal to win. 
Open this door right now. Told you. I'm not gonna do it. Go away. I'm guessing this is some sort of flashback. Ooh. I can't move. Uh, my brain wanted to dodge that, but the game wouldn't let me. Oh good, I'm not dead. Great. I was about to say, the game's over. Thanks for playing, guys. This voice actor sounds tremendously familiar. Sounds like a... What the heck was that dude from Resident Evil 6? Was it Jake? Yeah, he sounds like Jake. Our prophet fills our lungs with water, so they may better love the air. Oh, yeah. Drown me so I can appreciate breathing. That's a great sound logic there. Now I, now I don't feel bad about taking your money. What do you say to that? I no longer feel bad. <laughs> uh, very interesting. Across the Delaware, with flaming sword and wings of angels, watch over me and lend me strength. Shield my mind from fear and doubt, so that I may hold fast against all invaders. Father Washington, hear my Father prayer. Washington, like George Washington, because we saw that statue. Okay, well, you know, whatever. A rebel against ignorance and tyranny. Share with me your wisdom and let the light of your good judgment shine like a beacon through the darkness. Father Jefferson, hear my brother. Okay, that just pretty much confirms that they're talking about the Founding Fathers. Maybe maybe they're just like history buffs, you know? Scroll. Okay. Amen. Okay, we've seen those twice now. A sword, a scroll, and a key. No chance, no luck. Yeah, right, kid. Just because the city flies don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. All right. So I've got a girl to find. Banana. Soda pop. Sure. I'll just eat all your food and take all your coins. Yeah, there it is again. I have an AD tattoo on the back of my hand. That's very awkward. After death. Just to keep with the whole religious theme going on. What a scene. <laughs> That's crazy. And it's nineteen twelve, this game says? Crazy. You guys barely had cars at this point. <laughs> For real. Everyone looks like a bunch of thugs, or all the dudes, I should say. I don't like that type of hat. It makes you look like, you know, something, something not friendly. Give me some hot dogs, bro. Or, sure, I'll just, like, eat them right in front of your face. That's cool. Sweet. Free food. I like this place, after all. Give me that paper. You're just gonna wave it in front of my face, huh? You're not even looking at me. Oh, now you're looking at me. Stupid kid. That statue. I just think it fails to capture Father Comstock's absolute. Delicatessen. That's a good place to get some food. Life does not matter to a Liberty Scout. There's no room for preference. Only duty. Wow. She sounds like a great mom. And fatherland. Who could be against all that? Everybody looks the same. They're just reusing sprites already. We're, we just started the game and they're already reusing sprites. Hey, this is the guy from the menu. Honest, my dear fellow, they are a temperamental and unreliable lot to a man. Uh huh. I told him that the park is exceedingly far behind schedule. 
the, the, the landscaping is half finished. The, the statuary hasn't arrived. The fountain is full of rainwater, for God's sake. Even the marigolds are still unplanted. All work which should have been done months ago. Do you know what he told me? He said that he was tired. That, that the work had taken much from him. I said, good God, man, don't tell me about details. Just get it done. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You almost finished down there? Yes, sir. <laughs> Never had to uh, experience shoe shine. A little too young for that. Oh, nice! Old fashioned movies! Marks <laughs> a little bit. Is that it? Okay. Awkward. I don't even know what the heck was going on right there. Some sort of propaganda, I'm sure. It'll be a. What does Fox Popular even mean, for heaven's sake? It's Latin. It means. Oh, I wanted to find out what that means! Yeah, very slow approach so far to the game. I'm just trying to learn as much as I can for the moment. Um, so not too much action in this first episode, which, you know, that happens. Whatever. You're gonna get your nice clothes all wet. Uh, you're gonna get them dirty. My mom will be screaming at me. Horse. Wait a second. That's... Is there a horse in there? No, that's definitely electronic. Well, that's my jump button. I thought my jump button was something else. Okay, well now I learned how to jump. Does that mean, like, Earth? Like, oh, well, Sodom, maybe. Can't be everywhere at once. You'll always miss something. That's why we're going to the raffle. I have a good feeling this year. Columbia Raffle and Fair. Huh. Oh, get out of my way. I'm trying to find loot. <laughs> Honor system, huh? Man. Well, how much does this stuff cost? I can take the money, apparently. It won't even let me pay. Well, maybe I have to buy something first? Do I even want anything here? I guess I'll take that. Uh, nothing in there. So the only thing I can get is a first aid kit and a banana, huh? And a chocolate cake. How do I pick up the health kit? Oh, it just ate the health kit. Snarf the health kit. I didn't need it. How do I pay money? Oh, there we go. Cool. Take that, honor system. And another movie! Beware the false shepherd. Why are the subtitles getting in the way? Is it him? 
Is it him? Is it that guy? Is it you? I don't know, who could it be? Oh. Okay, that's weird. Whatever. Whatever, Karl Marx. Is this girl? Wait a second. Wait a second. That AD on the back of the hand is the same that I had. Hold, hold on. Don't tell me I'm the bad guy. I just got here. I just got here, ladies and gentlemen. Shoot, if I'm the bad guy, I'm gonna go take all that money in that thing. Uh, sure, I'll take a flower. You remind me of Aerith. You're selling me flowers at the beginning of the game. I'm gonna buy one. They won't let me buy one. How do I buy one? Dang it. I always buy a flower from the flower girl. One man goes into the waters of baptism. A different man comes out. Born again. But who is that man who lies submerged? Perhaps that swimmer is both sinner and saint. Until he is revealed onto the eyes of man. I'm surprised those don't have subtitles. Okay. Well, I'm making progress. I'm trying to, at least. Columbia's gayest quartet. Now, does that mean, like, 1912 gay? Or 2013 gay? Because that's actually, ironically, a rather large topic these days. I don't know. It is four dudes up there, after all. <laughs> it could be either one. We will leave it up to your opinions. Oh, they're playing rock, paper, scissors! Okay, okay, I got this, I got this. Cooking up a pot of wind over here. I have to see if they're doing three or four. Says there's shoot. Okay, they're going on shoot. Okay. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? They're going on shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, I had paper. Wait, what is that kid doing? He's cheating. What is that kid doing? Was that paper or scissors, kid? What is that? That's literally both. That is you, you cheating little kid. What a cheater. What a cheater. Don't put him in that honor system store. He'll cheat. Stupid kid. Doesn't know how to play rock, paper, scissors, for God's sakes. That's where they said I'd find her. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Wait, what? Telegram for you, sir. How do you know who I am? How do I have a telegram? Mr. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert I'm Tom Stark to your presence. Stop. stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77. Stop. Lutess. Hmm? Okay, I don't know who Lutess is. Uh, if that whole stop part was awkward to you, that's how in the old days on telegrams they would... Uh, notify where the differences between where sentences were. That's essentially their period. I forget why. Because um, I thought they were charged like per word. And so having stop was supposed to be cheaper than using a period. That doesn't make a sense to me. But I forget. I forget the reason why. I just know that that's how they used to do it. Um, Lutes. I don't know. Whatever. There's nothing over there. Oh, maybe there is something over here. Just health. Nothing in the trash can. I'm already at max health, so I'm not going to bother eating more snacks. I gotta get back in shape, not worse. Uh, nothing over here. Hello there, friend. How's it going, buddy? Would you kindly offer me some of that popcorn? Let me through here, pal. Streets closed for your safety, pal. They're prepping tonight's fireworks back there. There's enough TNT back there to blow Peking to Kingdom Come. Again. Roadblock. Better find another way around. A way to tell them that. Uh. All right. I guess I can't go through there. Where am I supposed to go? Go to Monument Island and find the girl. Oh, 
Oh, she, somebody just told a joke. I missed it. I like jokes. Oh, I thought the first second those were the wacky, wavy, wild, inflatable something, whatever. Would you believe me? Well, friends, I am here today to tell you. Those are no flights of fancy. Those are no tall tales told behind the pool hall. No, sir. No, ma'am. Those are biggers I'm talking about. Brought to you courtesy of Mr. Jeremiah Fink himself. Cool. Who amongst you has tasted the divine gift of the vigor? One swing and feats of wonderment are cool. at the tips of your Cool. I guess vigors are uh, this game's plasmid. Oh, nice. Another movie. These movies are bad. Like, I don't really want to watch them because it wastes time, but I feel like I'm supposed to watch them. Oh, I was hoping I could just skip that one little scene, not the whole thing. <laughs> what? Wow. Wow. Really? That was a commercial for cigarettes for kids? That that needs to be made simply because somebody will make a disgusting amount of money on that. Like, put sugar in it or something, and kids will go nuts for that, that stuff, I'm sure. Carnival games. Let's make it happen. Hit the devil three times. Where is he? Oh, he's behind there. Okay. I'll wait. Boom. That was easy. Okay, that was easy. Thanks, carnival guy. I got this. Wow, how does everybody not win that? Boom! Carnival game, Dominator. Dude, there's carnival games everywhere. This looks amazing. The Vox Populi are on the loose. Who will hunt them down? Hey you! And if with a rifle? Well, here's a brave fellow. 20 points to win, huh? Alright, this will be our first test of, uh, of shooting something. Where, what do I shoot at? What the hell do I shoot at? Oh, there we go. Infinite ammo? Well, that was fast. Are you kidding? That was fast. I missed that one, too. There's 20. <laughs> what did I get? What did I get? Well, I mean, I know I saw I had 20, but how many did I get after that? Somebody tell me how many points I had. I'm curious. I'm two for two on these carnival games, man. Uh, I can't exactly buy that. Information, huh? Uh, <laughs> you don't know a thing, do you? <laughs> What's a boxophone? What's a boxophone? Exactly that. A personal record of voice. Hey, just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. <laughs> he was very quick to, uh... I usually wait till Fink works out the kinks with him. It's safe in that way. There's George Washington again. Sorry I'm all distracted playing carnival games. I wanted to have some fun. Did I do all of them yet? I only did two. There's a juggling thing. Can I juggle? I can juggle in real life. You don't look like you're having any fun. Clowns are supposed to smile more. You need some scars. Oh, here we go. Here we go. The key to these things... It, well, okay. I won't control it at all. I didn't control that at all. 
The key to those is angular momentum. You just want to take the largest amount of distance possible to get help use gravity get you more acceleration for more force. It's not always just brute strength on those. Oh, there you go. Kids with minor victory. <laughs> minor victory. What a name, too. Man, that is that is literally genius. What's this one? Use air shotgun? Sure, why not? I need 20 points to win again, huh? 20 points. Okay, that was easy. I gotta shoot 20 of these things, though. Alright, well, this isn't very hard, but... You know, whatever. The reload on this thing is bad, that's for sure. If they give more than one at a time, I'm gonna have no shot. So far, so good, though. I mean, I've hit them all, so I imagine getting 20 shouldn't be that difficult. 16, how much time do I have left? Second place? I hit all of them that you gave me! That's bull. That is bull. I hit every single one you guys gave me. What, do I get like more points for where I hit it, maybe? Maybe. Maybe I hit them in the wrong spot. Oh, well. Okay, I think that's everything. I'm supposed to go that way. Oh, there's nothing else up here. Okay. Oh, there's Lutess. Moon people. So I, don't, I need to find out who this Fink guy is and who this Lutess chick is. Uh, where am I going? Going this way. Oh, there's another flower girl. Have you ever lost a penny to a vending machine? Has a pay telephone ever refused to connect you with a beloved spouse? Well, it's time to take back control from the men of metal. With possession, you are the master. You will bend any machine to your will. Which one of those? The metal! You can't kill the metal. Jack Black has taught us that. Whoa. Whoa. She looks a little scary all of a sudden. Okay, she definitely looks a little scary now. What the hell just happened? Okay. Press to turn machine into allies. Oh, nice. Just like the little commercials they gave us for plasmas in Bioshock 1. Cool. Press right mouse to make a friendly machine, or to make a machine friendly to you. That's actually really cool. Salt's full. Is salt my mana? I guess salt is my mana. Alright, well we finally made a bunch of progress. Sorry, pal. The raffle is all sold out. Entrance is reserved for dignitaries and very important personages alone. Guess and that don't mean me. You try using possession on the ticket tag. Oh, duh. Uh, right trigger? Well, if it isn't a sentiment, Buford, your spot at the raffle awaits. Don't know why I didn't recognize you before. On. Always good to have gentlemen of your caliber at our flying fairgrounds. I guess I'll just take some of that salt then, after I use some, uh, whatever. Nice! Heads or tails, guys! Heads or tails! Come on, let me through. It's 12 to nothing right now. Uh, I'm gonna go heads. Tails. Why are you going tails, Booker? I told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I imagined. Chin up, there's always next time. Whoa! Dang. Alright, well. Uh... Sing praise to the songbird. I was totally just about to end it, but now I feel like there's more stuff going on. Like, I want to end it right before something significant happens, but I don't know when that's going to be. Health kit and salt. Well, I don't need to buy anything yet. 
Like, I want to accomplish something in the first episode, but at the same time, I know generally you can't. They just naturally take longer. Zing! That was funny. Getting hit on by strangers. Bless her and keep her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting tired of listening to random people now. Oh. This little beauty? Ah, the whole division got them. We're gonna flush the box out of the skyline system. We gotta have the best. Huh? Those are the same two guards from before. I'd love to bust some box <laughs> Alright. Nothing up there, really. It said space hold to look. What, for here? Whatever, I don't care. There's, there's a, uh... That thing again. You shall know the false shepherd by his mark. Oh, crap. Okay, that... That sounds like, uh... Time to end episode one, guys. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Even though it was definitely very introductory. More of like a part zero than anything else. But this is, I'm, I'm very intrigued for the moment. I can't wait to uh, get everything started and start figuring all this stuff out. So thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy. Catch you later. And we'll see what's up with this uh, false shepherd thing. Maybe. Maybe not. Peace.